Okay, ladies and gentlemen, clean break of this high right here. Price is going to continue to 45. And uh, we all know 34 is going to be tough cookie, right? Clean break of here. All right, time right now is 928, a couple of minutes to open. All right, so we have to watch this 34. As long as the price above 34, as long as 34 is holding, 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 boom, we're going to see uh, um, the price to want to continue to 45. Now, in my humble opinion, that move to 45 is pretty much a, um, a squeeze. All right, it's a squeeze, oh, a, a squeeze, a, a bear squeeze. All righty, that's what I think it is. So we're paying attention, cl cl close attention to 34, right? It's a key level. Price is going to dance around it. A clean break about 34. Price is going down to 30 and more. Where, where more? Well, my friends... It's going all the way to 24. How do you like the bananas, Mystique? I love those bananas. <laughs> all right, that's where it's going. 24. Okay. Clean break of 34. Price is going to go down uh, 10 more points to 34. All right. And here we go. All right, so I'm expecting a choppy open, which is our worst, one of our worst enemies. I'm going to say it again. Look at the attitude of the market, right, this morning. Okay, so, you know, it's got an attitude today. All right, look at it. So, price is not taking our high, 38, right? It's not taking, it's not taking, it's not taking. Double top, triple top. Right, everybody knows that. We have a bearish bias. Bias is the weakest of the direction, of the strengths of the direction, right? But bearish nevertheless. All righty. To 34 from, from this high right here, from 38, 39, all the way to 34. 34 is going to stop it for a while. What do we want? We want a clean break of 34 because then we know that the price is going to be looking to go all the way to 24. However, as long as the price is above 34, then the, um, then the odds for the short term is a break of this high and a continuation to 45. All righty. Okay. And, and what's the action now? Chop. Okay. All right. So, so, long 34 right and we know that a clean break of this high right here it'll continue to 45 right we want a clean break of 38 so that we can ride it to 45 that's the bull action and the bear is is right here to 35 right okay so oh my god cappy look price is taking 38 well we exactly so what is 38 38 is a buy limit, 38, because we know that the odds are that it's going to continue going to 45, just like I've been saying all morning. All right, so you are long the bre clean break of 38 for seven points, just like I said a couple of minutes ago. And then 45, I'm expecting the price not to break it, but at least we're going to be up seven points, all right? going going long here we don't have any reasons to go long here 35 36 so we're not long here we had to wait for the break of 38 right we had to break for the for the break of uh, 38 to ride at seven points to 45 okay and 45 ladies and gentlemen is the first resistance now 45 is not a target it's a destination. Oh my God, really? Yeah, that's right. So it's going to be tough to consider taking a counter trend short 45. But let's see what happens, right? Let's see what happens here at 45. Okay, mistake. That's, uh, is that uh, 40? 44, 75, 45. Is that 45 to the tick, to mistake? The tick. All right, so those of you who are tough cookies, right? You just made seven points on the way up right 
Oh my God, Capi, but I didn't get out 45 because it went to the it went to the tick, man. So right now price is 44, man. What should I do? What? Let it ride. What do you think 38 is now? 38 now is a strong support, right? And um, and uh, where is the uh, where where is the price really looking to go? That's a tough one because remember what I told you, 45 is not going to be taken easily. All righty. And look, is that to the tick, Mr. To the tick. 45 to the tick, bam, two points uh, drop. But it's not a target. So, however, look, it's back to 45. So you can take your seven points right here, right now. Okay. Depending, of course, on your position size, you let it ride. But remember, it is... I'm, I'm waiting for these, the Goldman Sachs to call me and tell me where they want to take it, okay? And, um, and I think I know. All righty. It's, um, it's almost there. Oh, my God. Listen, it's not really, okay? So I don't, <laughs> so I don't have it. It's, it's so far away. Okay. All right. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. All right, here it is. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, 60. Target one, ladies and gentlemen, is 60. All righty, that's target one, 60. Oh my God, Kevin, but you said that. It's target one, 60. Okay, so the main play is, the main play is long, right? So remember, we want always, we always want to be on the, on check for the seven uh, must elements of every trade. Direction, up. Entry location and type of, and type of trade. Breakout 38. Expecting the price to go to 45. Stop it, call, just like it did. And then, and then, Locking seven points, depending on your position size. But we remain bullish, expecting the price to continue to 60. Is it guaranteed that it's going to go to 60? We all know that there isn't such a thing. Can we change hats to bear? Of course we can change hats to bear any second. Remember that we have a bearish bias. All right. And look at the 45. Look at the 45, right? 45. Look at it. Look at the 45. Price just went to. Price just went to a, a just a couple of um, just a just a couple of uh, points above 45. Look at that, two points 47, because we know that 45 is is resistance, temporary resistance, right? It, it goes to the tick, cannot take it. It drops a couple of points, then it takes it again. We have a bearish bias, which is the weakest of the bias. So we have. We have, um, we are on the lookout for a for a move down, okay. As a counter trend, the main play is bullish, and we still expecting the price to go to sixty, righty? Okay. So, so what do we do then? Well, we take advantage of this pullback right here, and we know that thirty eight and thirty four are supports. Oh, okay. All right. Um, but is it okay to to be short counter trend 45? Well, it's a destination. Remember, 45 was a destination. And I told you, I'm not expecting a clean break of 45. We already made seven points. I'm not expecting a clean break of 45. And look at the, look at the reaction off of 47. So in other words, momentum takes it up above 45 just a couple of points it cannot continue and then the bears the the bearish bias took over and look at the pullback all right all right so those of you who took the 38 the breakout 38 because we knew it was going to continue going all the way to 45 seven points this pullback is taking your trail, right? You're not going to let ever a winner turn into a loser, would you? Oh, okay. 
Alrighty then. Okay, so what do we do? We build back better. And we know 34 also. We know that a clean break of 34, price is going to continue going down all the way to 24. 10 points. All right, but that's not going to be easy. That's not going to be an easy trip. It's going to have a little bit of res of support here, 38 and 34. 34 is, is not going to let it go. All righty. Okay. All right. So we're counting on 34, a key level, 34, not to be taken, right? For the main play, long break of 38, and we are expecting a continuation to... Here it is, to 60, all right, to continue uh, developing, all righty? Main play, long breakout of 38. We knew it was going to go to 45 plus 7 points on the first attempt. 45 is not a target. The target is 60. So main play still... Um, the play in uh, command, all right? Pull back all the way to, G 37 mistake, right? One point below our 38. Exactly. What do you think happened right there? Build back better, just like I told you. This pull back all the way from 48 takes your trail, and what do we do? We build back better. The main play long plan that we have, expecting to take it all the way to 60, is it still on. What's the first support right here? 30, 38, right? That's the first one. Price cannot take it, cannot take it. Build back better here, long 38, 37. Or establish a new position low. Why new position? Because that, that drop took your trail. You're not going to let a seven-pointer go all the way to your entry, right? You get, you get taken the hell out, right? You get back in. That's what build back better means. You are all out. The, the pullback takes your trail. You let the price comes to your support. You believe that the main play is, is still bullish. Going to 60 from, from 38 to 60, that's 22 points, right? And that's what we're after right now. It's 22 points from here. Again, again, and again, until 34 is taken, and then we think that the price is going to go to 24. Clean break of 24, of clean break of 34, price is going to go to the low of the wave, 31. A little bit of shenanigans right there, and no, another bunch of bulls are going to try to go long, but what they don't know is that the price is below 34. And as long as the price is below 34, which is our key level, then we are expecting the main plate long to be invalidated, and then the recoil, this the counter trend short 45 that we didn't take because it wasn't a target. It was a destination, although we take it sometimes to seven points. We know that 45 is, is resistance, right? So, so the, you know, aggressive traders, of course you take a counter trend short 45, 46, 47, right? If we say that the price is going to 45, seven points after break of 38, it's because 45 is resistance. And what do we do? We buy support, we sell, we buy support, and we sell, <laughs> we sell support, and we buy resistance, right? Okay. But it's an aggressive trade. Why? Because we're expecting a continuation to 60, right? However, look at, look at that beauty, right? From 47 all the way to 37. That's, that's a beautiful 10 point, right? That, uh, that an aggressive trader makes. We made seven points. We build back better right here uh, at our first support. We're counting on the price not to take 34. 
and that's why we go long right here again at our first build back better with a new position expecting the price to continue fighting 45 47 47 45 47 45 48 and then come eventually continue to 60 that's going to be our target one right so that's our main play we are always though thinking uh-huh what if what if the smart money decides all of a sudden that's it i'm done going up i don't want to go up anymore boom this 47 double top i'm done with it now i want to go down then we have to be um cautious of it number one and and then we know that if it breaks 34 it'll go 10 points more down by way of 31. that's it okay and that's what we are at right now break of 34 invalidates the main play long validates it and then the counter trend short here now 46 right it's 40 beautiful 46 the mid range between 45 and 47 the counter trend short be, would become the main play starts as a counter trend and it end up being the main play for that to happen the price needs to destroy 34 and then um, we manage the short here 46 47 right 45 the second time is a it's a double top right it's a counter trend still so you want to be short right here with the micros and still long the main play with the es so i told you right Remember at the open, I told you, I'm expecting a sideways open, chop open, right? No follow through, no clean break. The only clean break that we had was our seven points right here. After that, look at the action, right? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, our job is to really, really be on the lookout for this action, okay? This is the most important action right here, this chop. Okay, so we are in consolidation right now, and we all want to know whether this consolidation is, uh, all right, it's, um, it's an accumulation or a distribution, right? Okay. Accumulation or distribution, all right? Okay. So, overall market direction sideways, okay? All right, so look at that. Look at the counter trend shore, the mid range, 45, 47. Look at it. Boom, bam, bing, right? This is the second time, and now we're not gonna buy this 37. We're gonna buy 34, okay? Oh my God, Cappy, I'm aggressive, right? No, 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 the second, the second time, no, all right? It's a couple of reasons. Number one, look at the counter trend shore, 46. Look how beautiful it's working, right? So, so the, the 37 long work the first time, the second time we're not gonna do it. Here's 34, it's, it, it, it's, it's breaking it right now, and we know that, right? So, so, so ladies and gentlemen, we know that we have um, 31, right? 31 is the, um, is the, um, is the low, of the way 31 48 right 31 48 all right okay so good so what do we want on a day like today okay ladies and gentlemen all righty then okay uh, uh okay ladies and gentlemen all right this 31 ladies and gentlemen just went just went all the way to 28 so it, it, it went it went down 28 points all right so listen to this all right so being long right here 34 now is very risky it's very aggressive what does that mean Cappy? it needs to be a clean razor sharp entry period it cannot go back to the to this little low right here, 32.75. Period. Even if it tastes 32.75, we don't want to be long anymore because we had to bring 
the low to 28, and that's too, too many points. From 31 to 28, that's three points that we don't want to fight. So this long right here, 34, that you just took, needs to be razor sharp entry, which it's being razor sharp, right? 34 that we've been waiting. I told you, we're not going to buy 37, 38, 37 anymore. We're going to let it go to our next support, which is this one right here. And I'm telling you even what type of entry needs to be for us to have the gut to continue holding it. It needs to be razor sharp. Price goes to 32.75. That's a, that's a buck and a quarter. All right? It's beautiful. We have a solid stop right here, 32.75, because we know that if the price even tests 32.75, um, it's too risky to stay long because it'll go now not to 31 like we had before, but to 28 and 24. In the meantime, we are still long the third time, our third, um, look at that. Trade number one, trade number two, and this is our trade number three. Long, long, long. Okay? All right. So a day trader needs to know not only direction, where is the price going, and where where is the best entry, because we're scalpers. We're, you know, we're not Warren Buffett here. All right? So that we can have the best risk reward ratio. Get in, get out, get in, get out, get in, get out. All right, where? Uh, uh, okay, as long as the price is going our way, then we get out where the system says that it's a strong, en a strong enough resistance to get out. All right, okay, so those of you locking nicely, right? Those of you locking. Uh, seven points on the first uh, tray, another seven, eight points on the second tray, uh, 34 to 41, seven points on the third tray, hanging there. If we're going to have a choppy open, look at this choppy, it doesn't get any more choppy than this, 34, 37, right, it, right, look at that, 34, it was 34, 38 at the beginning, and then we finally got that break, and we knew it was gonna go to 45, and we know 45 is resistance, right? And this is, you, you gotta be strong. This 45, counter trend short 45, is not invalidated until the high 40, 47 is clean taken. All right, so that shore is still going, All right? Okay, and remember that we've had a bearish bias. So we are expecting eventually some sort of a drop, right? So that's why we didn't hesitate on counter trending shore uh, the second time, the 45, all right? Counter, main play is still long, Expecting the price to break the high and continue to 60. That's the main play, right? And that's why we went long here, 38. We went long here again, 38. And then the third time I told you, that's it. We're done. Now we're going to wait for the, for the next support, 34. Boom. We, made, we had a razor sharp entry. And now we are enjoying this action. Even though it's so choppy, we got to do what we gotta do. We gotta stay with what the market gives us. All righty. Okay. All right. Okay. At all times, we have to have uh, full on, 100% complete concentration. All right. Not only we need to know <clears throat> what the price is gonna do, but how it's gonna do it, meaning where, where's the price gonna go? Oh, okay, such and so, yeah. And tell me something, what? How's it gonna get there? Oh, this is how it's gonna get there. There's this little resistance here, there's this little support, this is the main play, this is the counter trend. Because remember, every trader 
is different. Every trade is different. Some traders like to go to target one and they're all in, all out. Other traders don't counter trend. You don't have to counter trend if you don't want to. No, I'm just going to go with my play, right? Other traders only counter trend. So some of you are only short 46, 47. Because you only counter trend expecting the price to continue going your way. And if it, and if it comes right back, then you're, you're, you're a scalper. You get the hell out, right? And, and that's my job. That's what I have to do here. Tell you everything the market is going to do. All right? So both bulls and bears take advantage of it. Because the price is not going to go anywhere on a straight line. Right? So why not take advantage of the ebb and flow? Right? I've been telling you, 34 is a strong support. As long as the price doesn't take 34, we're expecting it to go to 60. That's for the bulls. We. And the bears is what? 45 is resistance. So let's go ahead and take a shot short 45, but not with the ES, because it's that any short is a counter trend. So we need to know at all times what's the main play and what's the counter uh, play. All right? All right. So every trader, like I said, is different. Bulls and bears. They're both making money here. Those who are going long the low here, they're, they're making beautiful money. And bears, those who are going short the high of this channel, they're making money too. We are making money with both. How do you like that? That's what a true professional does, right? Take advantage of the ebb and flow. Go long the main play, and we're sure the counter trend. All righty? And we always on the lookout, and we always want to know exactly um, what are the odds as to what is going to happen next. We think that as long as 35, 34 is holding, the main play has a good chance to, for the price to go test the high for the third time, finally break it, and go to 60. And for the counter trend for the bears, for us also, what do we want? Well, what do, we, what, do, what do we need to know? Well, we need to know that as long as the price doesn't clean take the high, right, then it's going to continue going down. It's going to go to 34. It's going to have a little bit of shenanigans right here and eventually break it and continue to 28 and 24. All right, so 34 is not target one, it's, it's a destination, and 28 is also a destination, and 24 is target one for the 47. All right, 47 minus 24, that's 23 points that the counter trend bear traders are expecting. So because we are both long here, 34, and short here, 46, then clean break of the high, then we're not sure anymore because we think that the price, because the odds say that the price is going to continue to 60. So why the hell are we going to stay short anywhere? And if the price goes ahead and, and takes 34, why the hell are we going to be long anymore if we think, because remember, we trade what we think, all right? We are... Um, we trade, we, actually, we trade what we see and we trade what we think, all right? But when we're trading what we think, we are some traders that only trade what they see. You know, they are reactionaries. We are both. We are active, right? Not reactive. Like traders, what, traders that trade what they see, they are reactive, right? We are active. We're both. All right, so at all times, we want to know what's going to happen next. And look at your p &L and look at this massive chop. What time it is right now? 10.08. There are no economic releases today. That's why the market is in, in this, this type of action. Okay? This is not a Lambo day yet. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, guess what? We're going to bring... We're gonna we're gonna bring 31 back. 31 is back in business, ladies and gentlemen. 
31. That 28, forget about 28. 31. Okay? So, 31, 34 is no man's land. It's going to be tough, right? And um, we still think that the, uh, the medium term uh, play is the long. So, so we're good with being, we are, we are good, right? This, this new reading that I have, that I gave you, uh, look, at, look at it. <laughs> I told you, I'm going to have a new reading. And, and um, about a couple of minutes ago, right? And look at what just happened. Look at, look at this beautiful uh, move up from 37 all the way to 43. Five points in five seconds, right? All righty. Okay. That's when I brought 28 back to 31 again. So now 31 and 38 are closer together, right? And uh, we are long right here. This 34. And we, and we are still expecting the price to break the high and continue to 60. Small odds, but that's what we still think is going to happen. All right, so we have a new reading. Market is dynamic, it's changing all the time. We had to bring 31 to 28, and now we just brought it back from 28 back to 31. All right, so we have a com confluence here. And, um, and uh, we know 38, of course, since the open. Right? Look, look how beautiful 38 is holding. Look at it. Look at it. Right? Right? That break of, of 38 at 951, when I told you we're not going to buy it, now we're going to buy this. The next support is, it, it looks, look, look at it. Look how it behaves. It takes it. It goes all the way to 3275. It takes all the stops of the weak bulls those bulls that don't know that the smart money is looking to take the price all the way to 60. They don't know it, so they, they got scared, they got shaken out, and then a couple of minutes later, boom, back to 38. And now, of course, we are in a horrible chop. Chop, 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 chop. Look at that chop. Look at all this chop. Since the open, time right now, 10.17. All right? No, but we know exactly what what to do, no matter what, and that's that's what a trader needs to know at all times. All righty, okay. So look at your PNL. Remember, cha is our worst enemy. Look at your PNL. Go to phase seven if you want. Look at your PNL and uh, and make sure that. Just like we never let a, 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 a winner trade turn into a loser, we don't let a green day go red. All right? If, if we don't, if, 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 if for you to maintain your green um, uh, status that you have right now in terms of being profitable for this session, um, you don't have to, uh, you don't have, you don't want to trade anymore. So in other words, you have to make a calculation right now. Well, if this thing goes ahead, and goes and plummets all the way to 31. That's gonna put me in red if I stay there. So you make sure that you don't go in red. You have to stay green. All righty, okay. And then come back tomorrow, period, that's it. Not every day is a Lambo day. So look, so look at this job, right? It's some, are you kidding me? A lot of traders are already gone playing golf, that's it, they're not going to put up with this job. They know the odds of trading a choppy day are against you, right? So they're out of here, they're gone, golf, tennis, whatever the hell, barbacoa, whatever the hell they do, they're out of here. So you have to think the following, we, on the other hand, are long the low and short the high, right? Think about that, <clears throat> all right? All right, just because our long-term play says that the best odds are being long the low, just like we are, and that's why we are long the low the big position, 
um, that is going to go to 60, that doesn't mean that uh, that we are expecting a trending day today. No, uh, not at all. All right. Overall market directions is still sideways. Okay. Alrighty. Okay, so this is a, a tough action as it gets. Why? Sideways. Job. Alright? Our worst enemy. So you've got to you've got to be a hundred percent fully concentrated, right? Okay, my friends. Alrighty then. Okay. You have to listen to every single word I say, every every single comment I make. Because remember, you are the trader, all right? I'm just telling you, okay? Okay. If you, 99% of your concentration to me to listen to every single word I say, that's not going to cut it, all right? Okay. I need 100% of your complete focus. Otherwise, this room is not for you, period, all right? Go hobby trade somewhere else, not here. Here, we need full focus, period. All right, so I'm giving the market my entire, complete, full attention. You give, you, you give me your entire, complete, full, full attention if you want to make uh, your, your membership uh, worth it. All right, look at that. All right, look at that. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, gee, what a... What a what a what a shocker! The price couldn't take the the high. Look at this one, two, a triple top, right? Look at this triple top. All right. So we have to continue putting up with the uh, the sideways action. All righty. Okay. All right. Well done. Of course. Okay, so good for you, buddy. All right, look at that. 34, 44, right? 10, 10, 12, 30, 13 points. That's pretty good, right? Look at this. Look at this. All the way to the high of the rectangle. Okay, so you're gonna get a lot of trader trading educators. <laughs> All those. All those phony trading educators trying to tell you how to trade a, a, a channel. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right? After the fact. It's so easy after the fact that right here, right now, during the hit of the battle, go ahead and teach me how to trade a channel. Go ahead. Teach it to me. Live, real time, as it's happening, right? You're going to get a lot of trading educators, quote unquote, desperate to sell you their phony, their crappy trading education garbage. And they're going to teach you, you know, after the fact, they're going to show you a lot of charts. And this is what you do and this is what you do. And they're going to show you a Photoshop of their P&L. Yeah, sure, we believe it. And then they're going to have testimonials. Yeah, sure, we believe the testimonials also, right? Just go ahead, right? You want to you wanna teach me how to trade a channel like this one, a choppy sideways action like this one? Do it live, real time, as it's happening. And let me see you do it so that I believe that you are actually a real educator. That's so funny, man. It's unbelievable. These trading educators, they can learn a thing or two when they when they watch this video, right? <laughs> when we post it tonight on, on our channel. Okay, this is for you guys. This is for you to go back, watch the video, and, uh, and, and see what you did. Come on, baby. So what do we want? We finally want a break of this high, right? That's what we want. Why? Well, we prefer a break to the upside because that's the position that we have um, uh, bigger, right? That's, that's, that's our ES. So that's what we want. <clears throat> we prefer, right? 
Okay. One thing is what we want, and another thing is what the market is going to do, right? Two totally different things, right? All right, come on, baby. Go ahead and take it and uh, so that we can get out of here, right? And just come back tomorrow. Okay, remember, right? 40, 37. Okay, 40, 37. Right, 40, 37. Okay, right, 37. Look at that, 37 to the tick. Right, okay. All righty. Right, ladies and gentlemen, so. <clears throat> Clean break, right? Oh, okay, so that doesn't mean that it's gonna go to our 24 in one straight line, right? Of course not. Okay. All righty then. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so look, Remember that we had our support at 28 and we brought it back down to 31. Look at what just happened. It momentum took it. 31, right? 31, 28. These three points right here is no man's land. Okay? Pretty much. Alrighty then. Okay, now the clean break of 34 invalidate the main play being the long that we weren't wanted to uh, we, that we were expecting to go to 60 and then the counter trend short the high becomes now the main play and what it is what well, that we are expecting now to happen well of course 3128 was going to stop it right not gonna go to 24 and one straight line but now we're changing hats along with the market and now that's what we believe is going to happen and we have confirmation right here look at the way the price breaks our 34 remember 34 34 34 I told you two hours ago above 34 we have a bullish bias below 34 we have a bearish buy. we had a bearish buy of overall market direction chop erased all of that not big but we still know that 34 is a very important key level price destroyed 34 right he went to our support 31 and now long here below 31 is now the counter trend and the counter trend the high short 47 is now the main play and the main play we are expecting the price to continue going all the way to 24 a predetermined pivot that we've had since 9 a.m this morning now is it gonna go on a straight line i don't think so that's not the way the market moves All right, that clean break of 34 made us change hat, expecting the price to continue to 24. That doesn't mean, however, that 60 is out of the uh, is uh, is out of the out of out of our plan. No, we're just gonna put it in the back burner. All right, market decided right here at 10:53, right after after two hours of chop. To, to destroy the stops of the weak bulls. Yeah, okay, sure, it took hours too. We knew that 31 and below was support. We knew that, right? Okay, for the short term. But for the longer term, we believe now that the price is going to continue going to 24. So this rally right now, the higher it goes and 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 reaching our levels of resistance those are entry shorts for re-entry shorts for us expecting a continuation to 24 
Okay. Okay, let's see. 60 is in the back burner. I'm telling you. This is a nasty, choppy action that is going to take forever. All right? And remember what I told you. Phase 7. If a braid is going to put you in the red, you have to make sure that you don't let that happen to you. All right? And you get the hell out and you come back tomorrow if this is too choppy for you. All righty? However, we've known all along that we wanted to be short the high, which is 47, and long the low, which was 34. 34 until the price takes 34. We knew it was going to go to 31. I told you. 31, 28. Remember, we brought it back from 28. And then it's fine support, natural bounce. But the bears, my friend, they are the one in control, and they're, they're looking to take it to 24. All righty. How? More chop. How do you think how it's going to be? More chop. Now we just have a different uh, channel right now. 38. 28 is 10 points right here. 28, 38, 38, 28, 28, 38. All right. Is it possible that we have to change hats back to bull again? You bet it is. It's called chop. That's exactly what happened, right? When the, when, the, when the smart money breaks right here at 10.53, it breaks like this, hour 34, that's the smart money taking the stops of the weak bulls, period. That's all there is to it. We knew it was going to go to 31. So, of course, we're not going to have a sell stop 34 if we think the price is only going to go to 31, right? That's three points. We're not going to be short right here. That's not going to happen. That's why we are short right here the counter trend, which is no longer the counter trend. Now that 34 has been taken, now the counter trend becomes the main play, and we are now expecting price to go 24 before it goes to 60. But I'm going to tell you again, I can change hats back to bull any second, I have to see, take by take, minute to minute, bar by bar, right? Every single move that the, that the, uh, that the smart money is going to do now to make sure that they don't get us by surprise, all right? But we have a plan. Stick with it, okay? Don't be surprised, okay? So what do we want now? We know 34 is the first line of uh, resistance, right? So, counter trend short the high, 47. It finally breaks to the downside. It, it becomes the main play. We, since 10.53, change hats completely to bear, expecting the price to go to 24. The price bounces all the way to 36. A couple of points above our 34. It cannot uh, hang around above 30, our 34 too long. And then it breaks down again and it breaks down again. What do you think? What do you think the odds are as to what's going to happen? All right. Okay. Okay. So 24. Target 1 for the counter trend short 47. And... The add to a winner right here, 34 again, right, of course. And or the add to a winner or the establish a new position short when, when the price broke 34. And I told you, change hat, price is going to 24. So we want to shore our lines of resistance. What's the first one? 34. Let's take a shot from here, right, from this 34, 35, right? Not even 36. Look at it all the way to 24, 10 points, all right? That's what we're expecting to happen next. Time right now, God, are you kidding me? 11.07, is he gonna go in one straight shot again? I don't think so. It's called chop, all right, so. <laughs> I, th I thought I was, I've been talking to myself for the past uh, hour and a half because who the hell is gonna trade this chop? We, we are, so. 
I'm pleasantly surprised that there is still a lot of you here. Okay, so enjoy it. All right, 24 it is, right? Price 26.75, we're gonna call it 27. And is it gonna go in one straight shot? No, it is not. Okay, however, let's see if the price is, let's see, let's see what the price is going to do um, at 24. And um, if, it's, if the smart money is planning in taking it and continue going down to another, to a second support. Let me go ahead and look for it. But before I do, I'm going to tell you, I don't know, for the 10th time, do not forget about 60. Just put it in the back burner. All right? Okay, because we can easily change hats back to bull anytime. Of course, it needs to happen before 11.30. Time right now, it's almost 11.10. So it needs to happen in the next 20 minutes. If it doesn't happen in the next 20 minutes, we're out of here. 11.30, official shop begins. And uh, we have to be really uh, happy that we had, that we had a nice uh, green day a day light today all right so 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 now right um, since this 27 right here is a is a is is actually a um, a pivot low that makes 24 weak clean break of 20 here this this low right here is gonna take 24 and lower, okay? Just like that break of 34, right? Then now for for the counter trend shore 47, uh, what we want to see now is a clean break of this people low right here because it's going to take the price a lot lower than 24. And I'm measuring right now to see exactly where is it that it would go. However, as long as this 26 holds, we are still, believe it or not, in a big, now wider, but still massive chop. In other words, chop. What does that mean? That I'm not expecting a clean break of the low. I'm not expecting a clean break of the high. All right. It just, we are now, we are just now in a 20 point channel. 27. 47. That's exactly where we are at. But the main play, the, the, the odds are that it is the low, the one that is going to be taken. It's going to go to 24 and beyond. I don't have it yet, but as soon as I have it, I'll tell you. Because what do you want to do? You want to let it ride as much as possible to the downside. And lastly, <clears throat> the 60 is just it's in the back burner. <clears throat> okay? 60 for the bulls is just in the back burner. It's, it hasn't disappeared. <clears throat> Time right now. 11.17. All right, ladies and gentlemen. 34 to the tick. Right? But remember what I told you about 27. This is a people... This is a pivot low. So this is, it's not as strong as a, as a swing low, but it's the next thing. And the most important thing is the chop, right? 34. Now we believe that the bears are, um, are you kidding? let me see. It's, hey, listen, nobody is in, nobody is in charge here other than the snakes period that's it now what's a what's a good uh, resistance right 40 beginning 40 is an okay resistance now all right for the for the bears 40 we don't want to do anything here 34 this 35 either this 38 we're done we're done with all of this 40, that's it, for the bears, 
right? And the bulls, those who went long here, which we didn't because we have no reason at all to go long here, 26, 27. So we're not taking advantage of this. Well, taking advantage, quote unquote, right? There's no advantage here with this action, right? But um, the bulls, those who went long here, then they're gonna take profit 40. That's pretty much it. Tell me this doesn't make you laugh. What do you think this drop was? It took every single stop of the weak bulls. We are bearish, expecting the price to continue to 24. So I don't know, but uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Is that 24 to the tick? Well, actually, uh, one tick below. 23.74. We know 24 is support. So this is a counter trend of the all counter trend long 24. Why? Because the market is going to continue going sideways. Alrighty, so, so, right, so what do we have? Well, we've been buying the lows and selling the highs. The last side we saw, the last high we saw is being, as a counter train, it's, it's, it's taking forever, but we got confirmation right here that it was going to continue to 24. It just went to 23.75. From 27, right? From 47 to 24, how many points did you just make? Right? That's 23 points on this first target. That I was expecting for Goldman to tell me if I needed to put it lower. It's okay. Target one plus 23 points on a day like today. All right. Target two. 17. Target two, 17. Right. For whom? Are you kidding me? For those traders that are going to Stay still trading the entire choppy day. Yeah, that's right. As long as we're bearish, target two is 17. It's only seven points from here from 24. So 23 points, this chore, counter trend 47, 46, right? 40, 45, 46, you know, this, this high right here. Good for 20 points, 20, 21, 22, 23 points right here. And then target two is only 17. Main play remains bearish. And uh, time right now, 11.53. We don't, we're not gonna take any new entries. However, we're gonna continue writing our current short position all the way to 17 and uh, we have to continue seeing if the uh, uh, overall market uh, uh, if the intention of the trend is to continue going down uh, even lower than 17 and if it is where is it i have no idea at this point that's uh, that's pretty much it my friends all right, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a, a tough day. There's no question about it. All right? Look at look at the 24. This is laughable. To the take, right? We've known 24 for how long? All morning. All righty. Okay, those of you who are real traders, you know how tough this session was. Those of you who are real traders, you know that not every day is a, Lamb is a Lamborghini Day, those of you who are real traders know that one trade means nothing one day means pretty pretty little is the accumulation of weeks month that's really determining uh, if you know how good of a uh, trader and how profitable you really are 
one day means nothing for us, even though on the last trade, which is May, 23 points. Not to mention the open a couple of times and uh, just, just the longer term. All righty, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. And that's how the cookie crumbles. See you all tomorrow.